Yes, that's right, it's the Make Code Minute. And on today's Make Code Minute, I wanted to talk about using the Circuit Playground Express with Make Code as a USB keyboard. So what I have going on in this code right here is just two very simple things. I have two on button press events or button click events. So on button A, I am going to type the word hummingbird. And then on button B, I'm gonna type the words rocket pants, right? Uh, so you could type single letters, you can type uh, function keys, media keys, up and down arrows, um, but I've chosen to use it as sort of a uh, helpful little input device. So I'm gonna switch to something where you can see some text input. Okay, so here you can see I'm writing a letter to Phil and I say, hey Phil, it is time to deploy, and then I'm just gonna press one button, rocket pants, and you can see uh, to take over the donut shop. That place is full of, and I'm gonna hit the other button, hummingbird. Hummingbirds, let me move this out of the way. Hummingbird, I gotta go back and add an S. Uh, okay, so that's kind of a silly example, but uh, you can see that using uh, make code and these little USB keyboard input blocks, you can do a ton of stuff. So the way I've uh, set this up is by clicking on this advanced tab and choosing extensions. From here you add USB keyboard and that gives you this category of blocks. So you can type in uh, a command, you can hold a key down and then you can do these media keys I mentioned like uh, volume up and down or mute and uh, function keys as well as page up, page down. So uh, there's a lot of interesting things that you can do with a uh, keyboard entry from things like light levels, tilting the Circuit Playground Express, uh, the buttons like I've shown you, and so on. So that is our Make Code Minute.